Hey guys, and welcome to more Front Mission. Let's continue. When we last left off, we had uh, just done the final mission, uh, or the final secret mission, I should say, uh, where we went back and defeated some uh, scummy forces that were retreating over some very sacred, sentimental land. Anyway, let's enter town and go to the military ward. You let the terrorist leader go? Just like that? Are you mad? I'm going to have to report this to my superiors. They'll know what to do with you. Don't even think about running. I'll have you shot on sight. Dismissed. Oof. That's heavy. The colonel is serious if you disobey orders again. He can do whatever he wants with me after I learn the truth. The truth? All you care about is finding Karen. You're hoping she'd be she'd been sent to the Nirvana after she was taken from the hospital. In Grey Rock. Uh, Grey Rock. Why? Why do you love her so much? I, I, okay, a bit odd, but sure. Natalie. No, just go. I can't stop you. I've never been able to, have I? And I won't go with you. This is the end of the line for me. Goodbye, Royd. Oof. Heavy. All right. There you go, trying to sneak off on your own again. You know you can't fool us. This is personal. I don't want it to get. I don't want to get you in any more trouble. Anything concerning Sakata Industries concerns me as well. Everyone's waiting at the bar. Let's go. Ah, what a fine bunch of troops at the waterfall. Hey, there's Royd. Are you all sure you want to do this? Yeah, except for Karen and JJ. They went with Natalie. I told you I'd stay to see the day you die, remember? Thanks. I can show you the way to the Nirvana's facilities. Everybody here is ready to go. There's nothing you can say that would stop us, Royd. Oh, and I borrowed a new supply truck from the army for this. The PMO won't be able to put a dent in it. Well, that's not true, but <laughs> okay. We should leave soon before Olsen finds out. Yeah, probably a good idea. Fort Monas has fallen to the OCU, hasn't it? Yep. Hey, why don't you be... Ah, yeah, we've spoken to all these people. Yeah, I heard a, a blue zenith was ripping the defence troops apart. Well, I don't know about that. It's rare to see so many people here these days. So many people left Select after the Orvanes. Yeah, we know, we know. We've already spoken to these people. Right. Well, let's go. To war. So Karen, Keith and JJ have gone off on their own. That's fine. Karen's having a tizzy fit. Jealousy over our fiancé that she's never met. <laughs> Women, am I right? None of us were given clearance to come here. This must be Sakata's B device factory. Let's go. I've been expecting you. Ooh. This is going to get ugly. This is going to get ugly fast. Yeah, there's a lot of troops here. Driscoll. You're a little bit late, I'm afraid. You won't find what you're looking for here. That's a lie. Ah, good old Gents. How nice of you to join us. You couldn't have moved so many people in such a short time. True. That is, if they were still people. What have you done to them, Driscoll? You'll have to find out for yourselves. Okay, this one can be a bit of an ass, But I'm sure with the correct... Weaponry, we can pull this one off. Ah, we really are kind of down to the B team, aren't we? That's fine. Ah, I suppose this is why it pays off to balance your team out a little bit better. But we've got some good machines. So, uh, let's start by advancing. Now, Driscoll is there. Driscoll is tough. 
but he might take one or two of us, but he's not going to take all of us out. And we've got Gents. Now, this thing here, this, uh, this thing is monstrous. I'd like to think of it as like an Ed 209. It's extremely tough, and uh, the dual linked machine guns on it are just disgustingly powerful. So we're going to be abusing that. It also has a rifle as well, but uh, the rifle... Uh, I don't know why you'd use the rifle instead of the machine guns. Maybe that's kind of like a personal choice, I'm not sure. But if the rifle hits, it does a decent amount of damage. If the machine gun hits, it tears them to pieces. Which we will soon see. Yeah, so Driscoll's going to run away. But not forever. They've got some very advanced missile launchers here. Very advanced. They're not here to mess around. That's for sure. But that's okay. Paul's taken some knocks, but we can patch him up. As long as he doesn't get downed, obviously. Okay. Okay. Paul... I kind of need you to pull back, but actually, let's hold the line. Nice. That one's gone. Let's get Paul back out of the danger. I should probably level some of these guys up, really, but it takes a hell of a lot of time in the arena to level people up. <clears throat> time that I don't really have at the moment because my holiday is rapidly coming to an end. But we'll see. Right. Ah, you can jump down, which is great. Actually, that's Paul. Paul, you need to disengage. And perhaps chow down on a medkit. Alda, you can push. Hands, you can push behind the two weapon systems. Actually, yeah, if you can hit him, soften him up. Uh, go for the donkey, if you can. Not great. Bobby. Keep bringing up the rear. I'll pile as many people into the central position as possible. Yep, let them have it. Alright, a little bit of uh, grazing damage. It's better than nothing. Ralph, get mobile. Hit him with the crane. That crane does have one heck of a range, which is nice. Here we can chill there. Gents. <sighs> Gents isn't great. Um, but, you know, an extra machine is an extra machine, I guess. Yeah, Driscoll's just going to run away. Oh, God, that hurts hurts so much. Luckily we should be able to take, yeah we can take a hit or two. That's not a problem. Okay. Yihin, oh Yihin is nearly completely disabled. He's gonna have to disengage. Yeah they're all piling in. That's fine. We can tank it. Yeah, if those guys hold... Oh, that's curious. Not sure if I've ever seen them. So this guy is an attacker. We want the missile gone first. Take him out. Beautiful. He's gone. He's had enough. Into the scrapyard. Now, Ryuji, you can hang fast for a minute. Mayhua, I'm going to need you to move in and light this guy up. Did we use the wrong weapon? Possibly. But that's fine. At least we did some damage. <laughs> yeah, we might have fumbled that a little bit. 
Right, this guy needs to go down. Not bad, not bad. We need to remove that arm of his, if possible. That'll do it. It is a shame, as I've said before, like, when you aim for their arm, you or a body part in general, you cannot hit any other part of them. It's their body part or nothing. Beautiful. Get Bobby some XP. Ooh, that's not a fantastic place for Puranga to be, actually. Although... Attacker... Yeah, maybe we can do a little bit of damage. He's probably going to go out. That wasn't great. Not worth it. Yihin, Yihin is really bad. Yihin needs to disengage. Suck down a repair. Ralph, you're not exactly grade A material. So if you go down first, I guess it doesn't really matter. But if we can get you a little bit of XP, that would be nice. You know, for now, Peewee, you can just hold fast. Let's move Gents up. Ryuji, we really need you in the fight. Kill him if you can. Go for it. Kill shot. Wonderbar. Fred, let's get you back in, buddy. This is where things are going to start hurting. That's okay. That's actually okay. You know what? Hold. That'll do. This could be bad. Yep. Ralph is just completely lacking the experience for this kind of combat. Alright. We've probably got one solid round left in us. Uh, and then Roy is going to have to pack off. Because obviously if Roy goes down, it's game over, man. Game over. And... <laughs> nice. Why are they attacking with the uh, buggy? That's curious. But whatever. Kill him. Or close to it. Nope, that's definitely going to do it. Okay. Now, let's get tactical here. Fred, move in. Get that out of my sight. Mate. I want you to push on this guy. Attack. Yeah, we want the MG. There we go. That's the one. Such an incredible piece of equipment. Must have hit the rifle by mistake. It's fine. Paul is... Okay. We can get him slinging some rounds at this attacker. If you could get rid of that, I'd be very happy. Alright. Yep. That'll do it. Now, cowboy. Can we move someone out of position? Ralph. Ralph, you need to GTFO. Uh, get those legs patched. Peewee, you could probably push. Gents. Uh, you can try. Yeah, I thought that was going to go about as well as it did. Um, now, Alda, I want you to move in. Take him on. He's the biggest threat. Nice. That'll work. Hands. You can sling some rockets at this guy. Uh, try and get his other arm. Alright, well, it wasn't bad. Bobby. Bobby needs to disengage. Use a repair. 
Paranga. Oof. Oof. Paranga could probably disengage as well. Smoker repair kit. Yehin. Oof. Yehin, yehin, yehin. You're not looking great either. Yehin, you can chill next to Pee Wee. Munch one of those. Ryuji, you need to get back in there, brother. Take him out. That'll do it. Driscoll's going to keep running. That's fine. You can hit me. She can take it. Uh, I don't think Gents can. Okay. That was lucky. Those two are going to sit there jerking each other off. That's fine. Now, mm, right, Royd. Let's move you back into the pack. Chowing down medkits on the way. Ryuji, you're in pretty good spirits there. Go save Gents. Perfect. Okay, Fred. Fred can move back in as well. Sling some rockets at this guy. Well, I mean, I suppose fire for effect and all that. Um, let's let's get rid of this missile. Nice. Yeah, this thing's just literally unstoppable. It's kind of an unfair weapon, really. But you know, no time for tears. Everybody else can keep moving. Sling some rockets at him. Just potluck, mate. Alright. Wasn't really much luck there, was there? Elder, you know what to do. That'll do it. These weapons are so powerful. Hands, move back into the combat zone. Bobby, you can rejoin the combat. Runga, uh, you can as well, but you can have some med kits on the way. Yihin, oof, Yihin is just wrecked. But, you know, let's get him moving. Uh, use item, repair, left. Ah, oh, wrong bloody misclick again. I don't know why you can repair uh, sections of armor that aren't damaged. That's never been a problem until now. But whatever, I guess. Gents, you're just destination fucked, mate. Uh, you you can go sit in the corner and suck your thumb. Um, right. Royd can move back into the battle. He can get patched up. Legs aren't super important. If they go out, they go out, but... We're not going to cry about legs. Um, take the business end out, if you can. Alright, well. Scored a glancing hit. That's fine. Fred, move in. Give him a volley. Okay. Right, May. You can come around here. And waste him. It's just, it's just a slaughter, absolute slaughter. I'm glad it's not that effective when the enemies have it. Right, let's get the business end going. Get rid of that. Really? Ah, oh, no way. I've never seen, I've never seen that before. Never seen somebody miss twice with two volleys with every shot. That's impressive in a really sad way. No matter. That works. If 
you want this place so badly, it's yours. Unfortunately, we don't quite get what we want. It's no use. They've destroyed everything. If they didn't move the soldiers, then... What will you do now? The PMO forces will have your hide for aiding terrorists. What about you? I'll keep doing what I've been doing, and I won't stop until Sakata is gone. Why don't you come with me? We should take his offer. Sakata's project must be stopped. I never thought you'd say that. A son must right the sins of his father. Then it's settled. Rigi Sakata is currently staying in uh, Ripidis, which is in Eastern Huffman. Uh, Ripidis? That's a fair bit away. The PMO knows we're after Sakata. It won't be easy to get to him. All right, mission complete. Now we're not getting paid anymore, but that's fine. Can't be helped. But we're still getting paid per kill. Not sure how that works, but for gameplay reasons, I guess. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it there. I don't, th oh, we can actually move to a location and enter the town and save the game, which is great. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. When we come back, uh, I guess we're just gonna continue doing what we're doing. So, till then, guys, thanks for watching.